Ugh. Here we have pampered princesses. Well, I can see there are Mario characters here. There's Princess Peach. There's Rosalinda. And wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. Basing off that thing up there, I think that's supposed to be Samus from Metroid. What? What connection does Samus have to the Mario universe? First, we see Peach annoyed by the fact that the artist decided to put her in a diaper and it is messy while sucking on her bottle and for some reason dressed up as a skunk. Then we have Rosalina basically begging her, her friend to get her out of this situation, but she can't speak because someone put a pacifier-shaped tape over her mouth. And we have Samus, very interested in her diaper, while simultaneously sucking her thumb. As if she is actually getting off on this. With a Metroid pretty much sucking her brains out. And this is why she looks like she's actually enjoying this. Also, it seems like the Unthinker has also brainwashed this poor Luma into his twisted fantasy. A couple of Nintendo girls who seem to have gotten themselves into interest into an interesting situation. Don't worry, Rosalina, just a little longer. You'll be a mindless baby stinking up your pampers like your friends. Art by that guy. Wait a minute. So basically you're just reposting artwork that don't that doesn't belong to you? Also, being brainwashed, yeah, Samus will enjoy this. It just looks like Peach is very annoyed and she wants to get out of there. Also, what was the purpose of putting her in a skunk costume? Yeah, Rosie, you better get your wand and get yourselves out of this situation because this is not what I want to see me made out of some iconic video game characters. Okay. Let's read some of the comments. Diaper Boy Official. I like Skunk Peach best out of all of them. I also like to give a shout out to Unthinker, the creator of Baby Slash Diaper Stories, for making this art or whoever made this art. Um, this guy made the art. You. F oh, yay, my friend Fleur 4 commented on this. I wonder why the Luma did that. No, it was the artist who did it. He brainwashed Luma to do this. Diapered Marceline. No, not Adventure Time. I have a peach. I have a diaper. Uh, peach and a poopy diaper. I have Rosalina. I have a diaper. Uh, Rosa poopy. Oh my god. You say peach and a poopy diaper for the first part, and then you said Rosa poopy for the second. Oh my god. God, you mm! Pink basket, bo pinkest balloon. Oh, skunk pinkest peach is so cute. No, no, nothing in this is adorable. And what is wrong with their faces? Line works fine, shading and coloring seems to be okay, but it looks like you put more time into trying to figure out their diapers more than you did with and making the characters' actual reactions to the goddamn situation. Also, why did you put a Metroid in there? Why? Okay, I am having enough of this stupid diaper fetish, so I'm just gonna do one more picture and making sure it is god awful. Which is why I chose R Amy Rose in Diapers by the unknown publisher with a bunch of hashtags. First art, first piece of artwork submitted by the unknown publisher. It's not really good. Well, at least he freaked. He can acknowledge the fact that he made a terrible piece of artwork, especially since he put a diaper on Amy Rose, who is a 12-year-old girl, mind you. Okay, first off, let's get some of the things wrong in the picture, because we obviously know the first thing that's wrong with the picture. The fact that there's a fucking diaper on Amy Rose, a 12-year-old girl. First off, why does her head look like it was, was, sma it was almost smashed in with a hammer? Why is her head an oval? Why are her ears ridiculously wrong? Ridiculously long, I mean. Why did you put, like, basically no expression in her actual eyes? 
Because it looks like she was brainwashed into enjoying this. What is wrong with her bangs? Why did you make it look like her arms are completely separate? I understand drawing arms for positions like this is a little hard, but seriously. At least put in a little bit of effort. Two, what is wrong with her misshapen hands here? Also, this hand over here looks like she had it twisted the wrong way. I would understand since in some pieces of artwork I made, I made the same mistake of making both of the hands look the same. But seriously, you can't screw it up this badly. Also, Amy Rose's body is ridiculously long. And it seems like one of her legs... Also, one of her legs is in the wrong position. And so it shouldn't be like that. And also, it seems like her leg disappeared into her little stick figure of a leg... Of her second leg over here. So, in short, this artwork is just god-awful. I know he... Mention it's not really that good, but you should acknowledge you made fetish art and you made it really bad. Since this art, since this fetish is god terrible, you should not be making something like this. Okay, let's see if there's any comments for me to look at. Oh, yay! By Squeak here, Jun. Eight? What were you try? What were you trying to say? Does she need to be changed? And immediately after he said that, he kind of like fucked off and realized his god awful mistake. Lionheart Lee. Well, at least I can actually read this one. Aw, she looks so cute. Diaper girl Amy Rose. I look cute. No, you do not need to do freaking role play. You just don't. The lit J dude. Don't know, man. I don't know. Okay, I had enough of this for now. I'll still do the fetish, and I'll look at other bad art. So, what do you think I should look at next? Put in the comments below what artist you think I should do next, and I'll probably do it in another video. But if you're on DeviantArt, you can go and put it in the notes section of my DeviantArt account, Melody Cooper. Anyway, that's it for now. Have a lovely day, my video game nerds, and goodbye.